Hey guys, what's up? It's Sarah Jane. Thank you for coming back to my YouTube channel. So, <laughs> some trailers dropped. Um, and unfortunately, we missed a couple. So, we'll be catching up with them for the next couple days. Um, Dungeons and Dragons Dark Alliance gameplay trailer. Just dropped. I am going to be so excited! For those of you who don't know... I have a second YouTube channel devoted to our gameplay of Dungeons and Dragons. So we're kind of new to the game world. It's been fun. <laughs> it has. Yeah, we're level six now. Seven. Oh, yeah, we just got to level seven. So Tony is an uh, tiefling sorcerer, and I am an Asimar uh, cleric. Brave <laughs> cleric. So, it's been interesting. Um, yeah, I'm kind of excited to finally have a D&D movie or gameplay, I guess. A actual video game. Mm -hmm. It's about time. I just, I, I'm so excited. I can't wait to see if this is like a complete original storyline or if it takes place in some other part of the actual D&D lore. Or I mean, is it a choose your own adventure type of? If, if it's a choose your own adventure, I can already see the modders trying to go in, mod it to make homebrew worlds. I can already see it. Possibilities are endless. Right? But. I guess let's just jump right in. Alright. Three, two, one. We call them boulders, wraiths, uh -oh. giants. They call us snacks. So when those bastards come to claim your room, Oh, that's just rude! <laughs> Holy cow. Ah. Uh. Bards. Looks like barbarians. Yep, I'm pre-ordering. <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, yeah, nope. <laughs> I, I, this is going to be a copyright and I don't care. This better not give Susan any ideas. Hey, you're the one that already got us fighting <laughs> a young red dragon when we're at level six. Because you thought it was easy. You almost killed me. I didn't think it was easy, Sarah. After, if you remember, every session, I'm usually like, whew, we're okay, we're all good. I'm always usually like that. I never once said, that's the part that made me confused. It's like, I never once said this. No, you said, oh, we all pretty much have our health. And then I never really had to use any of my healing spells. Yeah, but that's that's all we said. I didn't made, I wasn't trying to make a big deal. That was a challenge for her. She's a DM. It's funny because I, I need to pay attention to what I do without, throughout the week. Because if I start looking up at monsters, like the week we're doing d and usually ends up being correct. Because the key pine, I was looking at it when I thought your cleric could have a familiar. And I was like, oh, that would have been interesting. Yeah, you did. <laughs> you did. Anyways. <laughs> so this does look very interesting. Um... Of course, d and is a big thing for geeks, and a lot of geeks play video games. So no, I think it'll do no, pretty no, well. No, no. <laughs> it'll do pretty well. In addition to that, like I said, the music's pretty darn good. Part of me wonders, though, if this is going to be something like the most common way of video games where there's like a season's pass or an expansion coming into it. One makes me wonder, 
Do we have to, do we have to fight uh, said demons in the Underdark? Talking about Into the Abyss campaign. I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm just saying. It would be nice to finally have something. Uh, even if it's a forced story. Forced singular story. It'd be nice to see how it would have gone. <laughs> if this is just a startup game. It at least has the basic races. And maybe the first few uh classes in that case i am still hoping to have play again a tiefling a tiefling sorcerer my first time going through if not i'll go to fighter <laughs> so let us know in the comments what you guys think <laughs> don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll see you next time bye take care